Hello people. Uh, so basically this is just a, a rough video. Uh, me and Emily have come out for a day um, to one of our favourite forests. Uh, it took us a while to get here but we're enjoying it now. It's a lovely day. Spring's spring's coming, you can feel it now. The nice uh, sun's nice and out and uh, it's feeling quite warm. Um, it's forecast a heavy wind today, but we found a nice little location and the wind seems to be kind of for the most part kind of blowing round us. Um, so yeah, we're just getting some stuff to fire. Emily's Emily's planning on doing a bit of campfire cooking. What are you making? Sweet and sour meatballs with rice. Sweet and sour meatballs with rice. And it works out quite well because that means a bit of wind. It works out quite well because that means I get my dinner cooked for me and I can just fuck about in the woods. <laughs> so yeah, we'll bring you back and um, yeah. And you need one from this angle. You didn't have your head in that one. Okay, so we just uh, got the fire going. I used one of those magnifying magnifying cards. I don't know what they're actually called. There is a proper name for it. But it worked like instantly because the sun's like beaming straight down at us. So that's pretty cool. I should have recorded it really, but it's too late now. It happened really quick as well. Yeah, it was just instant, instant fire. So, um, yeah, it's quite a blustery wind. So I think uh, this fire is going to burn wood quite fast. So, but there's plenty of wood around. That's why I particularly picked this spot. And it's getting battered by the smoke. Okay. Uh. So yeah, the fire keeps changing, smoke keeps changing direction. I think you're gonna, you need to move from there because that's happened more, more times than it should have done in the last five seconds. No, it was all right for a bit earlier. I'm gonna have a wander around and see what wild edibles I can find because I'm quite getting, I'm quite getting into that again. Um, ah, smoke. And it's your turn. Oh, wow. oh, it's a beautiful day. That'll work. Yeah. If it blows, <laughs> if it keeps changing direction, it won't now. Winner. Doing. Just adding the meatballs into the stock. What's in there? So we've got chicken stock, water, pepper, water. <laughs> pepper, carrots, and now I'm adding my own marinade that I made last night. Oh yeah. Sweet and sour, sweet and sour sauce. Not marinade. Oh, that wind. And then we've got rice in that pot there. Yeah. I typed it all up because I didn't want marinade in all in my bag. <laughs> Don't blame you. Is that a watertight container? Oh, that's... No. Wait, Don't have curries coming, them things. Yeah, oh, true. The other day. That's what it is. Recycled takeaway pots. <laughs> Smell it. Okay, so it's done. 
Emily has successfully cooked her first campfire meal. I can't see that because it's... Um, I haven't tried it yet. She says it tastes quite good, but I'm not convinced. <laughs> so I'm going to dig into this. And uh, then we're going to... Let me film you eating it. Why? I want to see your reaction, if you like it or not. I'm probably going to burn my mouth like I did last time. It's not that hot. It's the other meat. Try it with the sauce as well. We've got the kettle going as well for coffee it's like, after. It's like curry slash. I don't know, it's kind of blown my mind. Sweet and sour? Sweet and sour curry. <laughs> <laughs> right, we'll bring you back later. Okay, so we left where we were uh, staying for lunch. Sorted the fire out, left it nice and tidy, and now we've been walking for a little bit. And we've realised we've got no water left, so we've got to make a quick kind of hunts, huntsman's fire. Um, we've come to this stream, a little stream here. We'll get a little fire going because I found this, um, found a pine bough that fell down. There's plenty of quick firewood. So we're going to let a fire here and just pour some water. Da -da -da. You didn't survey your surroundings. <laughs> okay, so uh, a couple of seconds later, and we've got quite a good little flame on. That kettle holds uh, one litre so we'll be able to boil that up, have a good drink and we might be able to get another one boiled to carry with us, we'll see. Okay, so that's worked really well, we've got a boil on now. This the last few embers are burning down. So clean. Yeah, there's no sediment in it, is there? It's quite handy, you don't really need to filter it that much. So we're going to use this for drinking water and then we're going to, Emily just filled up that bottle to put out the fire. Couple of cars in the field, like cows. I do not pronounce cows, cars, but yeah, cars. Oh, some poison ivy. There is. Oh, I need some. Uh, I need a new hazel spindle. I wish I had a bloody. I wish I had a hazel woodland coppice woodland thing. Be a winner. Bit of a weird chunk there, but can hear the birds in the trees over there. It's definitely the uh, spring is definitely coming. It's getting warm. My feet are sweating in my winter boots. Time to get the uh, desert boots out again, I think. And we've both brought two far too many layers. Have you seen any squirrels or rabbits or anything today? No. I haven't seen any either. It must be. You think they start to still. Oh, there's a fire up there again, look. That's where they're working, the Forestry Commission. Okay then, so we are now walking back to the car. Um, we've had a good day. And it's had a good day doing a cooking. Um, I think you're getting into your campfire cooking, aren't you? Yeah. So she's gonna. Get some new recipe, some more recipes, and uh, that's going to be her little thing to do when we come out. I think. Right, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll see you in the next one very, very soon. Thanks for watching.